horse racing legend Lester Pigott, who was considered one of the greatest jockeys in the 20th century, has died aged 86, his family announced today. The nine-time Derby winner, who had a 46-year career and notched up a total of 4,493 wins, passed away a week after he was admitted to hospital in Switzerland. His cause of death or reason for his hospital admission has not yet been revealed, but his family told yesterday how his condition appeared to be improving and they hoped he would soon be returning home. Pigotti's son-in-law, Debbie winning trainer William Haggis, today said, sadly, we can confirm that Lester died peacefully in Switzerland this morning. I really don't wish to add much more than that at this stage, although Maureen will be making a statement later. Speaking at Haddock Park on Saturday, his daughter Maureen Hagassi had said he was much better than earlier in the week. She said, I went to see him earlier in the week and he is improving, which is good news. He's much better than he was earlier in the week and hopefully he will be going home on either Monday or Tuesday. Unquestionably, one of the greatest jockeys of all time, Pigot, rode his first winner, the chess, at Haddock in 1948 when he was just 12 years of age. Thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe, turn on the bell icon to receive notifications every time I upload a new video. Peace.